Hi friends, a quick tutorial on how you can upload your own templates into Planify Pro. Here I have a new project to upload your own templates. Go to Planner, Pattern, Background, both pages. Go to My Background and then here click on Browse and here you can upload your own templates. However, please always make sure you upload the JPEG or PNG format of your template. You cannot upload any PDF files, you can just upload them as a JPEG or as a PNG. I recommend you to go onto Google and then to type in uh, convert PDF to JPEG. And then I recommend you to use this website right here called I love PDF. So you can click on this website, you can import your PDF file and then it will convert it into a JPEG. Uh, which you can then download. So let me quickly show you. You can click here, select your PDF file, click on open, and then click here on convert JPEG. And then you can click to download the JPEG image, and then it will download you the JPEG format of your PDF file. So here I can show you, this is how the JPEG will look like. When you transform them into JPEGs, please also make sure they are not bigger than 500 kilobyte. I recommend you to maybe stay around 200 kilobyte. That's a great sizing. Then also make sure that when you open up the JPEG, just check if the quality is high enough. So if it is like you see right here, this for example would be a good enough quality to be uploaded to Planify Pro. So back to where we left off before, you want to click here on Browse. So here we are on Pattern, Background, both sides, Browse. You want to import your JPEG, so click on the file, Open. It will upload you the template right here on the right side, where you can then click on it. So you can click on the template, and then what you need to do next is go to right here, Outline, set it to Full, like this. And now your template has been imported. Now next, please make sure that you don't have any widget boxes on top of your template. You want to go here to edit layout, set it to on. Then you want to click on the widgets to remove them like you see right here. Okay. Now you can also have different um, templates on the left side and on the right side. So if you want to have a different template on the left side, you can go here to left side, my background and then choose a new template for the left side, for example. You can also choose a new template for the right side like this. Then for all the templates you upload, you can also further um, adjust the scaling, make them bigger or smaller. You can move them more to the right, to the left, or you can also move them horizontally like this. So next, I will also show you how you can import them into a digital planner. So for example, here I have a pre-made digital planner. Now, let's say for example, you would like to import them to the very last page here. Let's duplicate this page. And then let's say in here, you would like to have your own template. Right now I have duplicated the page. This one's a daily page. And now let's first remove all the widgets we have in here. Um, the easiest way would be just to go to Layout, Planner, um, transform it into a one box layout. So you just have one widget you have to delete like this. Go to Edit Layout, set it to On. Then you want to remove the widget like this and like this. Okay. Now that you have an empty template, you can go to Pattern, My Background. For the left side, you can just set here, choose left page. You can choose your pattern like this, your template like this. Then for the right side, you can choose something else like this. And then of course, you would need to further adjust it. So sometimes you need to uh, scale it further down like this. So all fits onto the page like this. And then for the left side as well, um, make it smaller like this, maybe move it more to the right side, uh, maybe up like this. And there you go. So this is how you can import your own templates into Planify Pro. Just please make sure you upload them as a JPEG file and please try to stay below 500 kilobyte. If you have any questions, feel free to always message me on Instagram or Facebook and I will try to respond to questions as quickly as I can. Bye!